this is another video to demonstrate the function of the sbit data type so i'm going to uh, so sbit is, is the sense as i told you already we can able to set the uh, any specific uh, bit of the special function register so i'm in order to demonstrate this i'm going for a, a project called sbit uh, demo so i'm just opening this file so first you let's try to understand the question we are trying to get a status of the pin zero of the pin in the port one and we are trying to save it and then later we are trying to send it to the port 2.7 we are trying to read the status of the port 1.0 and then we are sending it to port 2.7 so this is the objective of this program so as we know this so we are we can able to access the single bit of the special function register if we specify the bit address so we are we are trying to specify we are trying to declare the a specific pin of the port 0 through the sb data type so i am declaring the port 1.0 as an input bit and a port 2.7 as an output bit and again you need to understand more important thing is here we are making use of a bit keyword so which is primarily useful to declare the bit addressable memory area so uh, and again inside the main loop uh, we are having an infinite loop so thereby we are trying to copy the uh, value that has been read from the port 1.0 to some uh, to the uh, bit address we are trying to copy into some bit, uh, bit, bit addressable memory area location and then through which we are trying to send it to the output bit the output bit was represented with the pin number port 2.7 so in order to in order to uh, test the test uh, test the functionality at first i am uh, building the target errors and zero warnings in my code i'm going for the debug start the so my checking whether my code is running within the code size limit yes and then i'm opening the uh, port uh, port one port one and port two are, uh, are utilized in my code so port one and port two are opened so if i click the run button uh, i will not get anything why because uh, we need to pass on the input first so first uh, we need to uh, we need to pass uh, input bit is in port 1.0 so port 1 0 the bit so I am clicking this things so if my port 1 first bit is 0 the same bit the same bit value is being copied into the port 2 7th bit so if I am making this as high so I may can able to you can able to the 7th bit in the port 2 will be will be uh, set so if I am clicking it as a low the 7th bit will become low in the port 2 so this is the logic of the program I hope so. This video will be more helpful for you. If you like this video, kindly like, share and subscribe. Thank you.